The, uh, <laughs> and little bike is taking a beating. And that's the reason I do a, a pre-ride and a post-ride inspection of them. And, uh, you know, just check stuff out. Like, uh, brakes, pedals, make sure there's no bolts missing. Everything's tight and nothing's backed out. The uh, pipe mounts, which they have a tendency to get loose, make sure they're tight and everything. Chain and uh, your rear sprocket, make sure that's good. Oh, they ain't supposed to do that, huh? No. And that's what I was talking about. After that ride, yeah. Quite a few of them got loose. And I remember using blue Loctite on it. You can see that in this video. Uh, Loctite. And uh, I used blue because it was going to be, I was going to run it, see if I like it. And if I like it, then I'm going to go back, pull it, and put red Loctite on it. Because I've always used red on it. Uh, I didn't do it. So. It's all good. I just hopefully none of the holes are stripped out. But if they are, another thing I like doing is going in there with a uh, six millimeter instead of five. So there's there's no harm, no foul. But that's the reason I tell you I was very important. Uh, I did 20 mile, 20 plus miles on this one on that last video. I did 30 miles on this one one day. But I never really had any trouble with this bike whatsoever. The, uh, but uh, yeah, hit like and subscribe. Please leave me a comment. Uh, always do that inspection, especially you guys that have to ride these things to work. Uh, please do that inspection. It's very important because that could have stripped all the way out and I would have been stuck somewhere. But it got me home. I mean, it was running like that, so... I felt it when I got into the yard, and there you go. <laughs> but anyway, y'all have a good one, and thank you very much for watching. And please leave me a comment about this. Tell me what you think.